Okay, so today we're gonna be um, fixing this plumbing leak. It was a slab leak under the ground, but we're running a new PEX line down around over here behind the water heaters where it's gonna connect to. So now we're gonna be sending the line through the wall instead of under the slab. But to connect this new PEX with the copper, we're gonna be using these shark bite, well, it's actually not shark bite fittings. These are plumb bite made by Jones Steffens, but, um... John Steffens? Yeah. Well, Jones. You know who that is, right? On the commercial, John, John Stefanovich? No, Jack Steffen. <laughs> Jack Stefinski. No, Jack Steffen. <laughs> well, anyway, so we're going to be using these fittings, and they work just like the shark bite fittings, um, where it just uh, slides on. There is a gasket in there, that O-ring, that black O-ring in there, and then you also have those those teeth that grab the pipe. Now these work on the pecs, they'll work on copper, so we can join the two together like that. Um, what we have here is a mark, because this is one and a quarter inch pipe. So for these, it has a little chart on the back right here that tells you if you're using half inch or five eighths pipe or three quarter, or uh, in our case, one and a quarter, needs to be one and seven sixteenths in. So we use the tape and marked one and seven sixteenths. So that's how far this fitting needs to slide on here to. The bottom out. Till it hits that. So, and then we'll do the same with this up to the copper. So. All right, so we're gonna just slide this onto the pecs here first. Your hands in the way. Get them to the camera. I can't see shit, your hands in the way. Okay, let me see the camera. in the way. The whole thing's moving? Alright, you're gonna have to hold the uh, pipe so I can push it. Make sure that inner tube is on correctly. You ready? Yep. Push it forward towards me a little more. Right there. Might have to cut the end. No, I shouldn't have to. I think the middle thing's catching on the pecs. Yeah. Exactly. So. And it's the angle, I think.
There it is. All right. Now, just gotta slide it all the way. So you got it? Yeah. There it goes. I'll hold it more. You get it. Push as much as I can, but it bottomed out there. And you can see we're right on our mark, so we're perfect. Now, let's slide it forward. Let's sl slide the whole thing forward, Nate. You know, we might even have to relocate this uh, electrical. <coughs> is that far enough? Yeah, but the problem is this electrical, we're gonna have to put it on top of this, but we have to redo it anyway, so let me just maneuver that around real quick. Is there a hammer right there? Wait, there is a pry bar. Yeah, you got me a hammer. Get this out of the freaking way, man. On the outside, is it just turned down right there? Yeah. All right, so we're gonna mark this copper now at one and seven sixteenths. Which is just a sixteenth less than a, a half there. So, there we go. Now, I'm just gonna push that up on there. That would be easier. You can come to the outside in case I need help. There we go. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we are. Right there at the line. So there it is. Copper to pegs. Not shark bite fittings, but plum bite fittings, but it's the same thing. The only difference that I noticed between these fittings and the shark bite fittings that I find a lot at the big box store is um, the inside ring. I'll show you on this one. Open this up here. So this ring right here, it's moving around. See how it's like a brass? on here well on some of the other fittings like the shark bite ones that's actually plastic so i kind of like how this one is a brass in there now i don't know if that's just because this is such a huge fitting this one and a quarter inch fitting now this brand if it was like a half inch fitting like this or for um three quarter inch pipe maybe it's plastic as well for this brand i'm not sure but i do like that this is brass in there and not just plastic so um hope you enjoyed the video give it a like you know a thumbs up that really helps and uh subscribe and we'll see you on the next video